The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask on 64 is a video game featuring a spirity gameplay, a method, mode of display, and action, and creates demented scary visuals and fattening, crackling humor. This game has it all with an injection, altitude, or in time copy and paste effects. This game has general creativity, and minors shouldn't be allowed because this game is for the adults. But kids, if you can handle toughening puzzles, and diabolical mazes, and a lot of story elements, and other things with the adult crowd, then I'll give you a free membership to the fucking milk bar so you shut the fuck up! A twin turbo classic indeed. A fun twist of maniac game, but it delivers something new and fresh to the artists. The complemented storyline and futuristic timeline, which is very oddball like. But the difference is like leverage with fun comeback showrooms that drives the gamer very wild and kitcheting, which is a must buy to me and some standards. If you want this game, get it on Nintendo 64 or the 3DS. But the 3DS was better graphics and some other content that you may not recognize in the Nintendo 64 version. I'll give this game a 10 slash 10. It's a game with a border living in action with flower non stop ghastly scary surprises with fragments of the Yoden undead and faster automatically. That bores the middle aged schoolboys a tasty gift of dragging blood nonsense. It will confuse you directly, and that's why I say Majora's Mask, aka the best game in the series, well, one of them, I could suggest that you can have a guaranteed great time. And never put it down or frown unless you get stuck in the fucking area with gradual maniac muzzles and then love those dirty stupid dungeon traps that pisses us off and a flam monkey grub banana gun gets a burrito jizz ass dildo in your fucking ass. Comes in, never mind. Just fucking buy the game! Love the burrito mascot.